Are your characters inconsistent? Don't worry, it's not your fault. Are you tired of your character looking like three different people? Welcome back to Twin Truth Studios. I'm your host, Cece the Creator. And in today's video, I'm showing you how to make your character consistent. With Design AI, it makes consistent character building so much easier. Here, I'll show you. Let's make some faceless content. Okay, so in step one, we're going to open chat GPT. I'm going to ask the app to provide me with a prompt for an attractive adult female with enticing eyes and a beautiful smile. She has long, voluminous, voluminous burgundy, wavy hair and medium brown skin. I did not specify nationality or race. She is wearing a loose pink v-neck t-shirt with dark blue jeans and pink and white sneakers. She is standing, she is standing against a white background 3d pixar style all right here's your prompt and so i have a prompt for a character it says do you want me to expand this into a multi-angle character sheet prompt or just a single full body front post i did ask for multi-angle just so i can see the differences so you can use this for an expression sheet, an action sheet, or angle sheet. All right, so I then said generate a prompt for each angle. Submit. So it gave me front view three-fourths view, side view, and back view. I'm going to go with front view. I'm going to copy that prompt, and then I'm going to head over to the next step. Which is Design AI. On the home page, I'm going to select New Project, select 16 by 9 Canvas, and then I'm going to select text to image on the left side, TXTIMG. I'm going to paste the prompt from ChatGPT, select the image model. I'm going to go with Seed Dream 3.0. And then I'm going to change the aspect ratio to 16.9. Select the yellow generate box. And let's see what the image is it gives us. All right. Burgundy hair. So I headed back over to ChatGPT. This is the image ChatGPT gave me. So now I'm going to select the next angle, which is a three-fourths view. So I'm going to copy that, go back to Design AI, and I'm going to paste that prompt. And then I'm going to scroll down and hit the yellow generate box. And let's see what that gives us. All right. I like keeping my character consistent even when I change my angles. Perfect. So right underneath the picture, I'm going to select chat editor. And then a black box is going to pop up. And I'm going to say place her in a tropical forest 
with lots of green and vibrant tropical colored flowers walking a black panther change the aspect ratio to 16.9 and hit the yellow generate let's see what it gave us so i have to scroll back up to see the results all right and this is the image that it gave us it kept our character consistent and put her in a jungle with a black panther so perfect so i am going to show you a few more examples in chat editor place her skydiving out of an airplane with a pink parachute over a bright neon colored tropical rainforest let's see if i can get it more vibrant all right not bad this is the parachute image it gave us except for it looks like it kept the tail <laughs> it kept the tail of the black panther all right so this is an easy fix let's rerun it and see if it'll self-correct itself so regenerate and let's see if that works and nope it gave us the tail all right so this still is an easy fix we're gonna go to chat editor and I'm going to say edit and remove the tail. Hit the submit, generate. All right, and perfect. It removed the tail and kept the parachute seen. So next, I'm going to go ahead and go to chat editor again. And I'm just going to show you how we can edit and change her shirt to a white colored shirt and generate so now we're going to change what she's wearing while keeping the same character in the same scene and perfect same character same scene white shirt perfect all right yep it matches All right, so next, I'm going to go back in chat editor. And this time, I'm going to ask that they place her at a coffee shop with a friend drinking coffee. Generate. Scroll back up. Let me see the results. perfect however i'm going to hit chat editor again this time i'm going to ask to edit the image and edit the friend to 3d pixar style hit the yellow generate because he was looking realistic and i wasn't going for realism in this image so let's see if it fixes it as y'all know this is ai baby ai gonna do what it want to do perfect it did lighten her skin a little bit which is the problem with using the same image over and over so i just wanted to show you guys this way so you can see that it is possible to do a consistent character however as you start to generate more and more images it does start to lose some of its features, you know, like skin complexion. It took some of the brown out of her skin um, and just different things like that. So, all right. So we're going to go ahead and we're going to go back to chat GPT. This is some of the images chat GPT gave me. I'm going to ask to generate a text to image prompt of her on a boat fishing submit chat gpt is going to take my simple little prompt and expand it into an enhanced prompt so i'm going to copy that prompt head back over to design and i'm going to slide over back to the image go to the original image and i'm going to select chat editor underneath the image and that little black box is going to pop up and I'm going to paste my prompt in there. 
Make sure the aspect ratio is 16.9 and generate. Scroll back up to the top to see my results. And it put her in a boat fishing. Uh, it kept my character consistent. So to me, it's perfect. I uh, don't like the feet in the water, but I'm not going to be picky. Uh, that's probably because the prompt includes the pink and white description of her shoes. So we're going to jump over to the home page. We're going to select consistent character. We're going to select build your character. We're going to select quick mode to the left. And then we're going to start with only one image. And we're going to upload one of those uh, images that um, you would have liked. If you liked it, you would have saved it. If you have it, go back and save it. Download it. We're going to name her Clara. And we're going to start building. And then select use inconsistent character. So now it says at Clara. So now we're going to head back to chat GPT. I'm now going to ask for another enhanced prompt. So I said generate a text to image prompt for design AI with her standing in a tropical bright neon colored rainforest with exotic okay get, get it together exotic colored flowers walking a black panther on a leash so again i'm asking chat gpt to give me um this enhanced prompt i added she is wearing a safari style outfit submit all right so while that's generating i'm gonna go ahead and try this fishing prompt on the consistent character and so first we used it under chat editor now we're going to use it under consistent character just to see if it does anything different okay so i'm going to select the correct aspect ratio 16 9 desktop and then i'm going to select the big yellow box generate And let's look at the results to the right and let's see what it gives us. All right, so while we wait for that, I'm going to head back to chat GPT and I'm going to copy the prompt for the um, rainforest with the Black Panther and head back to design AI. And I'm going to paste this prompt under the at Clara character action and scene. And hit generate. So now we're going to see what both of these prompts that we just used in chat editor are going to look like with the consistent character. And it looks like it's giving us pretty much the same thing, but a little bit more vibrant colors. Look at that one. Perfect. So it is keeping our character consistent. All right. So I'm going to head back to chat GPT. I'm going to ask for another enhanced prompt. So generate a prompt of her skydiving with a pink parachute. And I said punk, good lord. I mean pink parachute. Thank you. I'm going to copy that prompt. Head back to Design AI. And I'm going to paste that in the character action and scene with at Clara in the blue, as you can see. So that's going to stay there. I'm going to delete this and paste the new prompt. So deleting the fishing prompt and pasting the um, skydiving prompt. All right. Perfect. It kept my character consistent and now she's skydiving. Here she is in the jungle with the Black Panther. 
She's fishing. All right. So I'm going to go back to chat GPT. Of course, this time I'm going to ask the app to generate a text to image prompt of her sleeping in her bed with pajamas on and the blanket pulled up to her chin. Submit. All right, so now I'm going to copy this prompt and head back over to design. I'm going to paste this prompt and select generate. So I'm just giving you examples, letting you see how to do it two different ways. One way is through text to image and use chat editor. And the other way is using the consistent character feature. So this is perfect. Look at Kara. She looks beautiful sleeping. Thank you so much for watching. And if you want to continue to have fun with AI, hit the like button. Let me know that you like my videos. And subscribe if you're ready to launch your own faceless content. And comment below. I'm ready if you're ready. All right. Until next time.